Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel and this is it. It is go time. You're watching Chips Challenge 2 Sloppy Seconds and as Vladimir himself says, this is the last level. Level 200 of Chips Challenge. Let's do it. This is Crazy 2, a sequel to Crazy, which was level 100. And in that level, you might remember, uh, that level had procedurally generated Sokoban puzzles. Uh, there's a giant computer in Japan that can just make block pushing puzzles, and there are more in this level. We have to solve, as as with last time, we have to solve, I want to say, uh, three or four of these. Uh, I'll pick out four of them, and then we will, uh, and then we'll get a key for each one, and then we'll move on. We could do all 26, but there is, uh, there's a lot of additional bonus stuff, but we're not going to do that. And that bonus stuff is where the name Crazy comes from. In fact, Crazy does not even begin to describe the bonus point situation this level. I will uh, mention that, however, in the description of the video, if you are interested in reading about that. But now we're going to run around and we're going to find some puzzles to solve. And uh, I will catch up with you as we solve each one of them. Uh, but we can try one here at the start to maybe pad things out a little. What have we got here? So... Okay, let's go ahead and... Okay, how do we get on the other side of this? Alright, let's try... No, 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 not quite, not quite. Although, we could get around in here, maybe. And, uh... Okay. That allows us to do this. And I'm gonna go ahead and push this one up into here. Makes me think maybe I've messed up, but I don't think so. Oh, ho, 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 no way. Do we already have the first one? We already have the first item up for, oh my gosh. No, not quite. Uh, well, hold on just a second. No, I think the, yeah, I done screwed it up, I think. Okay, so more Sokoban action. This is as classic and pure and undistilled as Sokoban gets. So, maybe this one is not the one, but we will find puzzles that, uh, that, 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 uh, that are solvable. There's usually a few that are slightly easier to piece out than the, oh, yes, ah, yes, okay, the ever, the ever useful secret eye, we haven't seen that in a long time. Is this thing hard or what? Well, uh, depending on what you're trying to accomplish, it can be hard, but, oh, wow, there are. There are many different Sokobons we could do. Up to, it appears, 48 different ones. Wow-wee. Yeah, and going here, this is how you get to the crazy bonus point action. Uh, this requires getting all the chips, which we are not going to do. We're just going to get the keys, and we're going to leave and never talk about this game again. But uh, be back in a second when I have uh, figured out uh, as I figure out variously each puzzle. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, we have 45 down. 45 looked like a solvable one, so I'm going ahead and I'm grabbing it. All right, let's move on. So now, where is our red door? Our red door is, I think, somewhere down this way. I think it was at the bottom here. Well, I could use the red... Okay, I have to find the red door that actually gets me through to the next area. 
That's going to be important because some of them only reveal bonus flags, but it looks like it's down here. So now we're moving into the yellow key territory and we'll be right back when I find, ooh, this one, this one could be interesting. Let's see, well, maybe I'll see about it. We've got 44, 49. Oh, we've got way more than 48. It goes up even higher than that, it would seem. They crammed a lot of Sokoban action. Here's the bonus point timer. We'll talk about that later. Very crazy. But, uh, okay, so, yeah, lots of lots of new puzzle options. Let's, uh, ooh, 36 looks cool. Uh, a little cramped, though, a little, a little cramped for space. I think I'm going to go back and try to figure out 44. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and give it one cursory whack here. Um, how do I want to approach this? Can I go down in? Okay. I don't think I want to take. You usually don't want to take the button onto. You don't. You don't want to take the block onto a button right away. So I'm gonna go ahead and do something like this. Uh. Okay. Yeah, we have an opening to work with here. Um. All right, let's go ahead and see about it. Can I go ahead and then push this back up into here? Uh, maybe keep this right, no. You wanna do this button last, it looks like. So maybe what you wanna do first is get one down onto, I don't wanna push this one all the way down. Okay. No, yeah, I definitely do not want to push it all the way down. But I think we might be able to get on the other side of it. Okay, so we've got... Okay, just a second, just a second. Well, they're pretty much stuck there now. Yeah, I would want to get probably on the other side of this. So that, yeah, they're, they're all stuck now. I got two out of the three, though. 44 looks like it might be a manageable one. Uh, but uh, yeah, now that I know how to do 45, I can start the level over, go back and do that one, and then do them all, and do all the ones that I like to do in one pop. Ha! 44 solved. Man, these are a lot of fun, and I'm getting gradually through it. Um, so yellow key was back this way. And, oop, oop, nope, not quite, not quite. That's a block chip. You want to go through here to the blue court. Okay, that teeth is just there for fun. Okay, kind of scared me a little bit. But, uh, okay, we've got number 50 here. If we want to move on to another one, we could... Okay, well, we could do number 43 right here. 50, 50 looks interesting though. I'm gonna, 50 is right here and it's close to the entrance. Uh, 50 is kind of a tight squeeze, but let's give it a shot. Let's, okay, how do I, how do I, let's see. Okay, I definitely want to get at least one of these going maybe over here. So if I do this, if I do this, this one is eventually going to end up coming up up top with me. So what I want is to maybe, okay, uh, no, this is, this is yucky. So this one is coming up, no, but if I do that, then 
Wow, I think I've already screwed number 50 up. Number 50 is a tight squeeze. Uh, but let's see about it. Uh, maybe if I go... Yeah, I can't... One of these blocks is going to get stuck either way. Um, don't want one stuck in the corner. But I'm going to go with this one. Yeah, no, that's all kinds of... Okay, 50 is a fifty is a tight squeeze and maybe kind of yucky. But, you know, there's not much space there. Not many... Not many... Uh, there's kind of a finite amount of moves you can make there. So maybe 50 will be easily solvable just because of how small the space is. But let's maybe give 43 a shot. Maybe a first go here. Uh, I'm hesitant to... Okay, no, I... Do not want to push this one down first because then they're never pushable again. So I kind of want to get some of these. Ooh, yeah, 43 is a real tight one. But you want to go here first, I think, with it, and then here. Uh, let's see what that does for us. Okay, I can push this then. No, I can't push that one over there, but if I go from here and here... Okay, yeah, and then push this one down. Maybe I have some options. <laughs> not really. Not really seeing it. Wow, yeah, okay. Uh, this is gonna be... Yeah, 43 is also gonna be a toughie. Is there one that kind of... Let's see if there's one that kind of activates my brain right off the bat. 34 is a nice looking one. Uh, let's let's kind of have a look, see around real quick. And 31 is interesting, and it's next to the green key pile. So let's see. Ooh, this ooh, blue ones all look kind of blue ones all look kind of. I don't know. I'm kind of inclined to go with 50. Yeah, let's go ahead and give 50 the shot. Yeah, I knew there couldn't be that much to it if there were that few moves. That one was pretty easy to figure out. So we have the blue key now. Number 50 is in the books. And now we move on to the final corridor to hopefully earn ourselves a green key. Where are we going to find a green key? This one could be fun. Uh, also, so can number 52. Ooh. Kind of want to find a tiny one with not a lot of space involved. This one has some stuff going on what else what else we got 37 we could do a 37 no at least one person that would appreciate that uh, ooh 29 29 speaks to me 51 there are at least 51 to be solved been kind of rolling been kind of high rolling but I think 29 29 is calling my name let's try pushing out uh, ooh <laughs> okay. That's, uh, that's certainly a thing. Ooh, 29. Actually, 29 could get really sticky really quickly. So, but if I go here with the... Ooh, hey, okay. Uh, I'm kind of seeing a thing here. Ooh, are we actually going to solve one on the fly? We could. Okay, we've got kind of a Tetris T-block going on here. If I push this down... Yeah, I should have this, right? If I can just push them all down into their various slots. Okay. Oh my gosh, that was quick. Okay, well, let's get out of here just as quickly as we can. Okay, okay, okay. Green key, green key, green key. I'm coming. I'm coming home for you, baby. I'm coming for that green exit. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Let's open it up. Let's open it up and let's see what this game's in. I don't, I'm not expecting like a super theatrical cutscene or anything, but here we go. For the final time, let's go. At last you did it. Not just beat a level, but at last you did it. You beat the entire game. 
What awaits us from this point forward? Finished! Chip and Melinda have completed the challenge. They are true puzzle masters with a score, final score of 10,366,516 points. Press any key to restart. All right, well, a very... No, there's no Chip, be, Chip and Melinda being lifted up on anyone's shoulders here. This is a very... This is a very uh, Spartan ceremony that they had. Welcome to Chip's Challenge 2. No, we're saying bye-bye to Chip's Challenge 2. But so that is it. Uh, having completed 200 levels, I can say I am very, very, very tired. <laughs> uh, when you choose to play a game with 200 levels, uh, they're going to add up pretty quickly. Uh, to a lot of time spent, especially if they are very hard, as some of these got later on. But I think it's going to be a long time before I play any Chips Challenge again. Uh, Chips Challenge 2, you can tell it's a product of a different era. It is pretty bloated. Uh, I think I think they were operating under the under the assumption that more meant better, and that was not always necessarily true. You can tell. Coming into 2015, it was kind of like an unfrozen caveman kind of thing. Like, things have changed a little bit. Design decisions have improved, and uh, Chip's Challenge is a little bit behind the times, so it can be frustrating to a modern player. But if you stick with it, I don't know if there are any different endings. I, I didn't get enough points for that. But, uh, yeah, so, yeah, here we are at the end. So, what now? What's coming up next? Did I get all my thoughts out? Want to want to make sure I have all my thoughts out before I before I move forward and end this. But uh, I think I've said pretty much all I need to say about it, both here and elsewhere. So uh, that's it. Chips Challenge Two is a wrap. Coming up next time on Round the Wheel, that remains to be seen. <laughs>